Sabine, what's going on? We're being raided. It's a bloodbath. Her protocol is to wipe everything, including Bagley. I need him for the transmitter. I know, but if they get him, they get everything. Names, opt, locations. Okay, I'll do it the old-fashioned way. Wipe him. Yes, wipe me. Do it, Sabine, and get the hell out of there. Fuck. Okay, Bagley's down. You're on your own. Dalton, if this goes... with some important work. Important work? Killing thousands of... Exactly. To save the world. You do know Londoners have died before. Hmm? The plague, the great fire, the blitz. It's not much fun. But destruction is always the cure. And it begins today. Zero day. Oh my god. Months ago, a series of explosions devastated three sites in London. Authorities are asking residents to remain in their homes as the situation continues to develop. We have received no official casualty total, but it is expected for a series of candlelight vigils that brought closure to thousands of families and indeed to an entire city. London is now laser focused. They are sent Downing Street where Nigel Cass, CEO of private military company Albion, received a mandate to secure London. Cass has vowed to hunt down dead set. Terrorist response available. 
Albion used cutting-edge artificial intelligence systems and autonomous drones to capture the remaining members of DedSec. A stark warning to would-be insurgents. These top corporations are posting record profits due to increased efficiencies in production and distribution, enabled by the use of technologies initially developed and approved for security purposes. It's a long overdue cleanup as crime numbers take a dive. Illegal gambling, drug trafficking and prostitution all down following prosecutions of the leaders of four of London's five largest criminal syndicates, the streets of Camden and Brixton. ...as Albion's man normal. Curfews and travel restrictions have been lifted in all boroughs, thanks to the deployment... ...being news outlets, reports of rioting in Trafalgar Square have been greatly exaggerated, possibly by foreign meddlers pushing a false narrative through social media. Albion is in complete control of... A about the circulation of fake news, conspiracy theories persisting in dark corners of the internet that terrorist group DedSec were framed for the bombings have been roundly rejected. Our own reporters could not find a single Londoner willing to expound those theories on camera. The fact